Alrighty guys, welcome back to our episode of The Walking Dead. I can't believe this. You're gonna be fine. You're gonna be fine. Alright, so we're trying to get out of here. Looks like we have a hammer. <gasps> Come on, girl. Hammer a life preserver. What are we going to do with that? Um, an anchor. Hmm. Oop. A tackle box. So this guy was a fisherman, a boater. Not much left in here. I guess if I have to, I can use this for stitches. Oh, God. She's not gonna fix herself, is she? We need that hammer. We can take these nails out with the hammer. Hmm. Vice. It's not really going to do us any good. We need something. Ah, unfold the table and stand up on it to get the hammer. Oh, shit. It's not good for the wound. All right, where's the hammer at? Let's go pry these nails out of this board over here and maybe we can get out. Nice. Well, I guess we're out of here. I don't know if it's a good or a bad idea, but at least we're out. <laughs> now do we leave these people? Or do we try to go into their house? It, like, obviously, if, if we escape their shed in the middle of the night, they're not going to be happy with us. So maybe we should just try to leave? I don't know what... If I was in her situation... The doctor, he's got to have stuff for stitches. Oh, she's going to sneak into the house. Okay. If I was in her situation, I'd just freaking stay in the shed, man. Just try to rough it out for a night. Find a way into the cabin to obtain a needle, peroxide, and some bandages. Let's try the back window over here. <laughs> What about the side door? Nope. Come on. Shit. These people need to leave their windows open, man. It gave us a tapping option on this front window up here that we could tap on it. It makes me feel like a fucking idiot when we're not on the same page. We are on the same page. Not out there, we weren't. Not about the girl. I saw you get soft. What do you want me to do, Beck? Put a bullet in her? I want you to think about our family first. It's all I think about. So don't give me any shit. I need some air. 
Okay, now we can tap. He'll help us. What the hell are you doing? I... I need your help. Me? No. I'm sorry, but I can't do nothing. Please. I need to fix my arm. Are you out of your mind? Even if you ain't bitten by some lurker, which you probably are, you can't be here. You gotta get out of here, you understand? Get back into that shed and Carlos will take care of you in the morning. Do you just let me die? I wouldn't let you do nothing. It's not my call. We're a group. But you could help. And if you don't, isn't that the same? I don't know, all right? Guilt tripping, baby. To get out of here. I saw when everyone was arguing. You wanted to help. You didn't see anything. Look, you gotta get out of here before my wife finds you. I'm serious, you gotta go. I got enough problems already. I got a baby on the way, Rebecca's all emotional. Got a mess of hormones causing all sorts of trouble. Please help. Please. Don't cry. I'm not gonna cry. I'm just tired. You're not with Carver. No. And you didn't get bit by a dead person. No. I won't forget that you helped me. I bet you won't. Promise. I'm screwed if anyone finds out I did this. You understand? The bu the cut on my arm needs to be cleaned and stitched. Stitched? I ain't doing that. I'll figure it out on my own. All right, look. I don't know what I can find. We're short on bandages, but I might be able to find something clean that will work. I need something to clean it out with. And a needle and thread could help, too. I don't even know where to look. Carlos has medical supplies on lockdown. We don't got much these days. Well, whatever you can get, I'll find the rest on my own. Okay, wait here. Thanks, buddy. You're a good guy. I found you some bandages. That's it? <laughs> and, uh, I got you a juice box in case you're thirsty. Thank you. Alvin, house meeting in five minutes. Oh, okay, thanks. Now you need to go. Well, bandages in the juice box. Back to square one. You need a needle and peroxide. Let's just go in the front door. Yellow! Never mind. We should be able to reopen this window. It was just open, right? Ah, look down there. Get in underneath the house. This girl does not give up, man. She knows what she wants and she's gonna get it. Use the hammer, dip. And this would be creepy. Crawl space under a house? No thank you. that knife. Oh well, I guess we had to break it to get it open. <laughs> well, Luke has more to say, I guess. 
Where's Sarah? She's got her book. She doesn't need to be a part of this. Well, this is creepy. For some reason, I feel like the stuff's upstairs. Did that guy tell us that the medical supplies were upstairs? I know he said they were on lockdown, but... I've got a sneaking feeling it's upstairs. We need that splinter cell gadget to be able to look underneath doors. Shit. You're not supposed to be in here. Hi. Can you please help me? I'm not supposed to talk to you. My dad can't know. Help me, and I won't tell him. I... I'm hurt. Please help me. I, well, I shouldn't. What happened to you? A dog bit me. Sounds scary. I bet it hurts. You want to see it? Um, it really wasn't one of them. It really wasn't. Okay. Ew, gross. I know, right? You have to be it <laughs> like my dad does. Bonding with her. Help me. I need something to clean it with. And I need a needle with thread to sew it up. Do you know where those things are? My dad has some stuff for cleaning with his supplies. Kind of burns. I don't know if he has stuff for sewing, though. Really? Seems like he would. We don't have much. He's still trying to restock since we moved. I'll help you. Good. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. I'm Sarah. I'm Clementine. One of the options there was to say, shouldn't you be in bed? <laughs> what? Friends. Why would anybody right? say we that? Best friends. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. It's hard to be the only girl, you know? Rebecca is okay, but she's old. And that's it. Yes. We are friends. Promise? It's important. Friends have to trust each other, no matter what. I promise. Me too. Friends. <laughs> Pinky swear! A pinky swears forever. I'll see if I can find the stuff my dad uses when I get a gun. Let me look around. I think this is it. Nice. You can't do it here, though. Someone will find you. Don't worry. I won't. What are they going to say in the morning? Thanks, Sarah. If this all works out, if I'm just chilling in the shed with a fully stitched up arm out of nowhere, like what? Medical supplies in the bathroom sounds like a good place. Baking soda, toothbrush. Oh, there's a needle right there. It's clean. I guess that's all I need. I better get out of here. Now the question is, how are we gonna get out? That man sometimes. Hide in the shower. Get in the shower, girl. Damn it. Just need to have this baby. <laughs> I wonder what would have been better, the shower or the closet? 
Let it be okay. Let it be his. Oh, Jesus, you slut! That was close. 